the museum opened its door to the public in December 1998 at the behest of Dr. Mahathir during his first term as Prime Minister. Such works play an important role within the Islamic culture aiming to repair the morals and refine the souls of their audience. The Islamic Art Museum, Kata Museums, Museum of Islamic Art 2015 deliver to ancient Islamic Christians and take their visitor on a learning journey through the beautiful history. Let's discuss the audience. Uh, the first one is proposed creative proposition, which is to promote the Islamic Art Museum and successfully introduce these stories to the audience who will carry the meaning of the tales into their lives. And the next one is proposed marketing strategy, which is targeting audience to inspire and attract them to visit the Islamic Art Museum. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi taala wabarakatuh. My name is Dora Wati Fendi Abdullah. The project rationale: the opening of this museum was motivated by the museum director Syed Muhammad Al Bukhari. The rationale project aimed to educate all community, young and old, about the development of Islamic uh, and preserving for future generation to appreciate. The museum charged preserving and maintaining entire history of Islamic art, such as Quran and manuscript, India. China, Malaysian, jewellery, textile, arms and also ceramic gallery among the ambition gallery available at the Islamic Art Museum Malaysia. The foundation of this art gallery is not simply to knowledge the glory of Islam in the previous era or to judge other culture, but on the other hand, the ambition retained at this museum such as a particular unique reminder of how Islam was able to attain highest form of glory and become a global for the man. The functional requirement. The Islamic Art Museum Malaysia open space design aesthetic, which is continued and maintained throughout the art museum, give the creation of a successful, a fresh contemporary vibe and is a remarkable result of modern design and traditional Iranian and central architecture with magnificent aquarium, dome squaring, Kuala Lumpur skyline. Arms and armor, ceramic, woodwork, textile, architecture, Quran and manuscript, jewelry, India, China, and Malay world, and coin and silk gallery occupy two floors of this museum, which are additional two floors dedicated to temporary exhibitions. This is also the organization chart of museum in Malaysia. which is collection, information package, and for arrangement, which is method of distinguishing information package. There are four types of collection, which is art collection, reference collection, special collection, and running activities. Open collection is the most extensive collection which both subject cover on Islamic art and architecture, history, and religion. Uh, it comprises over 50,000 books including thesis and major publication. Registered staff are allowed to borrow from this collection. For reference collection in this museum, it is limited to in-library prints. The special, the special collection considered special because of each unit or the beauty of its physical. With over 5,000 uh, 5, titles in the collection of rare books, for an oversized book, limited edition, and audio visual item, they are kept in a specially controlled environment, separate from other parts of the museum collection, which is for an and manuscript gallery plates. These are only as a to the researcher in a design training uh, reading room, subject to professional professional handling regulations set by the museum personnel. For running activities, the museum is not only a tourist attraction but also an inner platform for gaining new information and knowledge and further expanding the thinking and understanding of the individual. Therefore,
know, several ways have uh, have been done by the activities in the museum to attract the interest, uh, especially of uh, students in introduce, uh, introducing the Museum Malaysia Islamic Art Creativity and Innovativity. Collection development and management in this museum has also been divided according to the available units such as management in the library or the library management department, uh, management department in the marketing unit and museum festival uh, and many more other branch. Every man manager in this museum is involved in every activity uh, done regardless of the upper level manager or lo uh, lower level manager. Each of them cooperate in perimeter not, uh, from the scope of their work such as exhibition activities, poetry, building, maintenance and etc. Uh, for information organization, the artifact Artifact and artistic value exhibition in this museum has given some of the insight and role in Islamic history education that other researchers can study. Among the examples that can be seen are exhibition that display the Quran and manuscript that have uh, indirectly played a role uh, in providing academic knowledge about the history of the Quran. The manuscript and uh, on display also allow researchers to collect information written on Wuba and animal, uh, animal skin using handwriting. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Sitina Asyarayana bin Isliman. Here I will present a buff law plan of Islamic Arts Museum Malaysia. The Islamic Arts Museum Malaysia has two floors of permanent galleries and two special galleries for temporary exhibitions. The two special galleries are located in lower ground and ground floor. For level 1, there are architecture galleries, Quran and manuscript gallery, the India gallery, the China gallery, and the Malay gallery. While in level 2, there are jewelry gallery, arms and armor gallery, textile gallery, the wood gallery, the coin gallery, the metal gallery, and the ceramics gallery. Next is facilities in Islamic Arts Museum Malaysia. There are auditorium, Moza restaurant, invent dome pavilion, exhibition space, museum shop, and additional facilities and activities such as children's library, storytelling season, and arts and craft lessons. of cultural property uh, as well as modern culture item such as con contemporary art literature uh, technology and record in museum are all part of information package uh, the first is uh, islamic art museum malaysia gallery distinguishing their information package by divide by two uh, floor which is permanent gallery and two unit gallery for temporary exhibition on the second floor uh, second is uh, books, print, journal, reference, resource, and audiovisual element uh, make up the collection and the information package. The third is a, uh, uh, besides in museum, shop, they also distinguishing seal item by a remarkable collection of books uh, which uh, focus on art and the Islamic world. Standard use in arrange all collection. All standard use in arrange the first Islamic art gallery collection is an Islamic calligraphy created with a variety of material including watercolor, acrylic, oil, pastel, mixed media, and calligraphy pencil. Each museum on as habit will be appropriately structured for word protection and also proper handling, as well as to protect the as habitation so that. It is maintained and not touched by random incoming visitor. Also, there are oil painting which must be dry before being sought and display. All drawing must have drill hook and wire attached at the back, which are three-dimensional objects that made uh, from metal, natural material, clay, rod, or glass are also acceptable. Reasons of why such standards are chosen. 
because there are objects on display Islamic Art Museum Malaysia range from jewelry to ornament, weapons, painting, ceramics, and, and replicas of Islam architecture have an inherent feature that show the way Islam supports a unifying force among a culturally and ethically diverse world population. And it shows that Islamic art proof unity not only in form but also in messages of peace, love and justice. It will also attract more local or foreign visitors because it world class collection provide universal perspective that suitable for multicultural countries like Malaysia or other similar countries. Assalamualaikum, my name is Nur Ali Atira binti Aliza. I will explain about storage space. The first is Museum Storage Cabinet. Islam Art Museum Malaysia keep their collection in Museum Storage Cabinet. Cabinet storage has been utilized as a tool for display material in addition to being a museum storage area. The use of proper cabinet storage is essential for the material collection preservation. Preservation cabinet and hard size cabinet are the types of storage cabinet utilized by the museum. The next is archival storage. The museum should adopt archival storage to safely retain all of historical collection. There has a large collection of Islamic artifacts with 2,500 on display and 10,000 more in the storage. Therefore, the museum must save and display collection in archival storage. Uh, the next is secure and safe. The essential collection must be safe and secure from any dangers. All other purposes such as office space and research activity are separate from museum storage. Also include a design compartment with a few plantation and excellent terminal efficient. For promotional space for new items, this one is marketing and communication departments that are responsible for advertising the art galleries and museums and their products to be sold. Many parts have been taken towards marketing and getting the audience involved in such videos. Way of classification Galleries are still classified according to the type of artifact or the field of study. The Indian Gallery, the China Glory, the Malay World Gallery, Architecture Gallery, and the Quran and Manuscript Gallery are all located on level 1 of the Islamic Art Museum Malaysia. Meanwhile, level 2 houses Textile Gallery, Jewelry Gallery, Arms and Armor Gallery, Coin Gallery, Metal Gallery, Wood Gallery and Ceramics Gallery. Collections are displayed thematically in each gallery according to chronological order production technique or region. Next is standardization. First, India Glory, China Glory, and Malay Glory. These three galleries represent the diversity of Muslims as well as Malaysia's multicultural heritage. Next, Architecture Glory. Architecture was the first manifestation of Islamic art and has maintained its dominance ever since. Next, Quran and Manuscript Glory. The written word highly regarded in Islam and the Quran is its ultimate example. Respect as the word of God is imposed of high level of responsibility on those who choose right. Manuscripts, however, are elevated to a sublime level by the combination of written words and non-figurative details. Lastly, textile gallery, jewelry gallery, Arms and Armour Gallery, Coin Gallery, Metal Gallery, Wood Gallery, and Ceramics Gallery. Ceramics, Metal Work, Arms and Armour, and Textile are stored in this gallery. Identification The origin of an object or collection of objects is essential to determine the element that describes that specific object. For example, Mirror of Beauty, Islamics are Museum Malaysia Children Guard. As you can see, there are the pictures, and beside it, there are the descriptions such as Auto, which is Islamic Art Museum Malaysia, 
cross, ears, size, ISBN number, and page. It's all from me. Thank you. User can view the Islamic Art Museum Malaysia collection by visiting their official website. The user can take a virtual tour because the Islamic Art Museum Malaysia provides a virtual tour to make it easier for the user to see the collection and feel the experience like being in a real museum. By using the virtual tour, user can select a twelfth of the gallery provided by the Islamic Art Museum Malaysia. In addition, the website allows users to access the collection at the museum at any time as there is no set time limit. If the user wish to visit the museum physically, the user can check the information in the website visit plan section to learn about the museum policy and operation hour. The user goes to the page about us. There is information related to the museum and a work obtained by museum and tour plans such as hour of operation, guideline at the museum and museum address. In the International Cooperation page, users can get information related to the travel exhibition, international project with MA scholarship at Prince School of Traditional Art and UNESCO Intangible Cultural Heritage Meeting 2015 and information related to the travel exhibition proposal made by the museum. On the gallery page, there is a museum plan show the floor position of each gallery available in the museum. The first floor has an architecture gallery, Al-Quran and Manuscript gallery, Indian gallery, China gallery, Malay gallery, while the second floor is Jalwe gallery, Textile gallery, Arm and Armour Gallery, Coin and Sea Gallery, Metal Work Gallery, Living with Wood or Lifestyle Gallery, and Ceramic Gallery. On the current exhibition page, there will be upcoming exhibition that will be placed in the Special Gallery, namely Gallery 1, Gallery 2, and Open Space Gallery. In the Conservation and Research Centre page, Museum provide the laboratory that can be used by staff and registered research to the conduct research, namely Organic Material Laboratory and Organic Material Laboratory. In education page, users can get information about children library, online resource and understanding artifact. In the scholar library page, users can find the collection by museum, latest book as well as opac offered by the museum. In the museum shop page, many products are available for the purchase, all of which are based on the unique collection of Islamic craft and antique from the throughout the world. The museum store are only sold in the physical store. In the publication page, users can get information related to the publication from the museum such as 16 books published in the middle of 2006 covering various topics. In the facilities page, users can find out the facilities offered by museum, namely auditorium facilities and Moza restaurant. The website only offers standard search features such as a search box, the user only search using keyword, year, title, and etc. The search features are not user friendly because does not offer advanced search such as allow user to search their information in more detail and easy. In addition, museum offer a site index that also facilitates users in finding information on the website. In conclusion, the Islamic Art Museum Malaysia is the largest museum with a collection based on Islamic art in South Asia. Many collections have been kept such as art collection and reference collection related to the art collection to attract public interest in Islamic art. With the use of advanced technology, the use of a virtual tour allow all the users who access the website can have the same experience as visit the museum physically. The museum used the standard of arrangement and classification used by all the museums in the management activity of all the collection. Lastly, the retrieval tools used by Access the website has many shortcomings in terms of search features as it's difficult for the user to get detailed search 
For the information, but the design of the website is easy for the user to understand.